And just finally, talking about former Rotherham players, I know for the last game of the season against Derby, Chris Wales is coming back a, as a guest. Mike Pollitt told us a, a great story about what Chris Wales used to sort of say in the in the tunnel before games to the opposition. Is that something that, that you can remember uh, from your playing days? No, you can't remember too much from your playing days. Yeah, I can't remember. Yeah, that, that is true. Um, he did used to say some crazy stuff. I think it was him and Torbs used to say, like, the Miller dogs and start barking and stuff like that, which was pretty unique but we were a unique group but it did have that togetherness and I'm not trying to be too much a romantic but that's the sort of togetherness I want to build with a group in the summer that you know they're pretty close they work hard together but they sort of play hard together as well I think you need that that good mix but yeah Swaz was um, a bit of a fruit loop I went to Oldham with Swaz as well so I was with him with him there and they it took some time for them to sort of get used to him he chased us I remember one training game training day there um there was a dead rat on the training pitch and he picked it up and ran after the group and the group literally split like marbles. I think he kissed the rat as well. He's just <laughs> one strange character. But yeah, is he st- he's still playing and he's playing. I heard he's well, playing a manager and he hates being uh, the manager. Mm. He said, that's not much fun, mm. which uh, judging by the lines on my face, I can uh, vouch for. But um, no, but Swa- Swaz was one of them, well, he still is, but a really good football character. Mm. So uh, I know he's coming to the game and another Rotherham ledge Revs is coming to the game as well so uh, hopefully it'll be an enjoyable last game of the season didn't Chris Wells used to apologise to the opposition before the game before they went out was that what Polly said apparently what and said what I'm sorry it's going to be horrible today oh, but I'm apologising yeah, yeah. now well, we, used to, we used to do a lot of apologies on the way off if we'd won 1-0 very ugly against the run of play like we'd had one shot on target we'd, we'd say look I'm really sorry it's bad for football but it's good for us we used to do a lot of apologising and we used to like obviously joke about how many throw-ins we won, which, by the way, I probably won the most. So they were good times, yeah, but we were yeah, an ugly side to play against.